How's it going guys? This is Nick and today I am bringing you a review of a site that I've been using recently. Um, I was in the market when I got my AR pistol for a holographic site or a red dot site and did not want to spend much money. So anyways, I was looking on Amazon like everybody does and I found a site for $49.99, so 50 bucks. And I've never really heard of the company. Um, but anyways, it is from Dagger Defense. If you can see that without the light messing up. It's from Dagger Defense. And anyways, I was like, oh, 50 bucks. Let's, let's see how it's about. It's probably not going to be great for the money. And I clicked on it, looked at the reviews, and I was blown away by the reviews. And to be honest, I'm blown away at what this site can do for $50. Um... So yeah, I picked this up for 50 bucks, and I absolutely love it. I cannot tell you the battery life so far. It has been perfect. Uh, I've ran this. I've probably shot, uh, probably shot 750 to 800 rounds. I want to say with this sight. But anyways, yeah. So this is the DDHB. Um, this is the red and green dot reflex sight. Is what this is. This is their reflex sight. And to be honest, first looks of it is badass if you ask me. This is a badass little sight. Got their logo up top there. Um, yeah, so for 50 bucks, I picked this up and I have been running this on my AR pistol and absolutely love it. I, I will be buying more of these. Like I have a 300 blackout pistol right now I'm building. And I need, the only thing else I need is a um, muzzle brake and a red dot or holographic sight. So yeah, I will definitely be picking up another one of these. I really like the uh, flat dark earth color. I did not know they had that one, but I will be picking that one up probably next. So that is badass. Yeah, so this is their red and green dot reflex sight. And um, you can see here, there is a little lever right here. And what this does is, it has, let me pick that up, okay. So it has different, has different reticles you can choose from. Um, if you can kind of see in there, I'm trying my best, to sh there we go. So the first one over here is just original dot. You have the EOTech pattern beside it, crosshair, and then the very right, that is like a, Kind of looks like a the BDC, I guess it's called. It's called or BBC. Basically, looks like an EOTech and a crosshair combined. But yeah, so you can change whatever you like. And I'm actually running the switched on me. Yeah, I'm running the EOTech right now. Is what I'm running. So you can see that dot. I'm running the EOTech. Uh, I usually run that or the red dot. That's like I said. I, that's why I got this saw. I wanted a holographic sight, so I run the EOTech on it. Red dot. It's probably my favorite, but I just like the looks of the EOTech, the holographic site better. Anyway, so you can change this. So for 50 bucks, you're already seeing you can change from four different reticles. Okay. So next, I'll turn this on just a little bit right here. I know this is the only thing I saw people complain about is turning it on in the color. The only complaint I saw was a little tight, like uh, trying to adjust, which I'm totally fine with that. I don't want something loose that's going to accidentally switch if I barely touch on I mean, You have to give it some good pressure, but I actually like that because I'm not going to have to worry about it like dimming on me or turning off or something like that. But So as you can see here, there's green and there's red. And there's another plus for $50. You got two different colors. I, depending on what you are, whether it's low light or really bright outside, um, I really like the green, just the looks of it. I'm a big fan of green. Um, I run both. It depends on what's going on. So anyways, there's that. And then, let me go ahead and turn this thing on. So to turn it on, all you do, so there's two ways to turn this on. If you go back one, that's red. If you go up one, that's green. I said, I'm a fan of the green, but I'll show you both if I can get this in, picture, in focus. Hold on. Alright. It's 
probably not going to look good if you can even see it from the camera. I just had it. There you go. Looks a little bright right now. That is actually brightness. I think it's all the way up right now. You can see that is a very clear picture. Like I said, guys, fifty dollars, and you're getting you're getting from this. And there's the green. Hold on one second. What is this one? Hold on. Okay. There is just the bait. I don't think I hit it right yet. There's the red dot. I know it don't look different, but it is. It just looks bigger on camera. There is the EOTech with the um, crosshairs, or the holographic with the crosshairs. And there is the standard crosshairs. So it's not picking up good in camera. It probably looks the same all y'all, because I'm kind of holding it back. If I try to zoom in, I can't really get this angled. But that is actual crosshairs. You can't really tell the. Um, yes, yeah, so like I said, you got two different colors, and then you got four different reticles you can choose from. Um, like I said, I like running the holographic side. I'm gonna probably start using the red dot next, um, just to switch it up. Okay. Show you the red real quick too while I'm at it. Okay. So here is the red. Come on. There we go. There is the red. And um, I actually don't have the brightness up that much at all. This is actually really dim right now. But you can just tell there's the red compared to the green. Like I said, guys, for $50, if I'm going to start running something on my gun and I'm really rough, I'm really rough with my guns because, let's face it, I I try to baby my guns, but when I'm running gunning, it's kind of hard to. I mean, that's what a firearm is for. You're not, I mean, yeah, take care of it, but it's got to run. So it's going to get beat up. It's going to get scratched. And like I said, 750, close to 800 rounds with this and not had a single issue. Battery is holding up good. Definitely, I recommend checking out Dagger Defense. Uh, their products. I have a set of 45 degree of uh, their flip up sights that I will actually be running on my AR pistol. Let me kind of show you real quick when it is done. They'll be ran on this AR pistol. Like I said, I'm not finished with it. Still need muzzle device and all of that. But it'll be on that when that is finished, whenever I get more money. Um, yeah, so I definitely recommend checking out Dagger Defense, guys. If you're in the market but don't want to spend too much money, but you want something worth the money you spend but don't want to break the bank, definitely check out Dagger Defense. You see, here's just the box it came in. Kind of tells you about it if y'all want to see this. So this is on Amazon, too, by the way, if you want to see the actual specs of it. I'm not getting into that. Um... I'll show you what you get in the box real quick. Get a dagger defense sticker. Get their manual of the sights and the different models. Yeah, right here is what I want next. That is a badass sight. You can see that. The one in the middle of that flat dark earth. And it is called, I'll show you what now it's called. There you go. That is a badass sight. That will be going through and blackout. Extra battery, clean cloth. It's pretty cool here. Here's another sticker, Strike Point. That's what it says. Yeah. And this is the B Bring tool. There you go. Let's see that. It's a card they have in here. Great company. I'll be checking them out too. And then, I lost one down here. You get two Allen wrenches, though. You get this one, and there's a little one that's under this somewhere. I'm not digging around for it. But yeah, guys, that is everything in the box. So go check out Dagger Defense, and this is the DDHB Reflex site. I will definitely be doing more business with Dagger Defense. I absolutely love their products. 
anyway, anyways, guys, thank you all for watching, and you all have a great rest of your day.